All right, we're here. Uh, first lawn of the day. Um, it's not too grown up today. Um, I think I cut it off schedule for the last cut, but overall it looks pretty good. Um, the edge isn't too overgrown, but could still use a, a shape up. So uh, knock this one out. And uh, I'll record probably a little later in the day. I have uh, 16 to do, so I'll try to turn the camera on at like every one. But we'll uh, we'll see how it goes, and we'll see how many I get to. So, all right. So I just finished up this lawn, and uh, this one right here, it came out pretty good. Uh, a lot of dollar weeds and stuff, but it edges up, you know, cleans up nice. So uh, these are two and three of the day. Um, and then I also talked to the homeowner. They want me to trim this tree. So I guess we're just going to trim it all the way around the top, the sides, the front, the back, everything underneath. And uh, yeah, I'm going to have to do a little research on that. All right, uh, over here at the fourth property, um, it's just this little patch of grass and that little patch of grass. Uh, I stopped and went to uh, Dunkin' Donuts and got uh, a coffee. So uh, yeah, we'll knock this out and uh, just keep it moving. All right, number five. Well, technically, I guess this is number six. I did stop uh, after Dunkin' Donuts and go to uh, another lawn. And what did I do? I had to just adjust the sprinkler system. So, um, but this is cut yard number five for the day. All right, just finished this one. It's like number six or something. Whew, it's a little bit in the backyard, but uh, yeah. Oh man, my allergies are really starting to act up now. So I think this is like uh mow mow yard like number six so uh yeah we'll keep it going it's almost um 11 o'clock so still got about another hour to do spending surfside and then uh yeah head um i guess uh well we won't be heading home but we'll be like mowing in that direction i guess you could say all right uh this one wasn't on the list for today it's a weekly but i had to get over here and just fertilize the lawn um just these little patches and then the the front so i already um i already um blew off the concrete and everything so um i'm trying to think how many more i have in this area uh, i think only like one or two more i'm gonna fertilize uh two yards um just on my way up to the next one and uh yeah, and then we'll have to go to one neighborhood where I have 10 in, um, nine need to be cut today. So that's that's kind of like where the rest are. are um, you know, say I have like one, you know, nine to do that are like uh, just over here in this small town. And then um, oh, the cops are out. They're out, I seen this guy. They normally don't bother me. Um, you know, I just wave to them and stuff. Uh, you know, don't speed or use blinkers, just stuff like that, I feel like. Um, and I've never been pulled over in Surfside. But anyway, uh, hope I don't jinx myself, but regardless, I could care less. Uh, so yeah, about to pull up to these uh, fertilizations and then uh, we'll keep mowing for the rest of the day. All right, just for the score, um, we're up to, this is uh, the seventh property we're gonna mow, uh, take care of today. And then, um, what, uh, seventh property, uh, to mow. So, uh, seven to mow, and we've been to three yards to fertilize. And, well, I've been to. And then, um, one more thing. Oh, I went to, um, the property that I manage, um, and let me think. What did I do? Oh, I just, uh, set the sprinklers. It was on for, like, four days a week. Uh, now I put them on for every day. Um, and then I also just checked out, um, an area that may not have been getting water, uh, two areas. Uh, I found one head was, um, just all clogged up. And then the other one, I think it's, it's more of like a shooting stream. And I think it should be more of like a 120 degree fan or something. Um, so maybe a hundred degree fan. So, uh, we'll see. I'll probably end up swapping that head out and, uh, yeah, so cool and then uh other customers too everywhere i go like uh they're like hey get the bushes too and stuff like that so um 
definitely stacking a lot of stuff up but let's just see how far we get today um yeah so let me get this chopped up and uh i'll catch you guys in the next neighborhood oh yeah guys look at this look at the green up over here looking pretty green definitely could still almost like dethatch like a whole whole little little area right here but overall very green so still a couple weeds in the yard and stuff like that um still almost got some moles what the hell some mole crickets still wow yeah that definitely feels like got a couple mole cricket holes right there what the hell here's another one so we'll have to come by see i think i'll double check uh, these definitely look like mole cricket holes so uh, of course but we'll get it taken care of but definitely get this mode that side looks looks pretty good i need to get this place like rolled uh, a sod roller or something uh, we got a little piece of fencing in the yard too but overall let's check out flower beds look good make sure there's no weeds make sure there's no weeds in none of the cracks either that way so when they come to town they say oh our mulch still looks good the guy's doing a good job taking care of it ground is a little a little squishy so i'll probably just leave the sprinkler system where it's at got the yard chopped up everything is uh you know in place edged up whatever you want to call it um of course the weed eater is uh crapping out on me right now and i only have one with me today um of course i bring the brand new one and uh, i got it this season so um it's running super restricted right now and of course it just like starts running super restricted it couldn't have done this like yesterday when i was mowing my lawn or anything it just starts here so um oh yeah it's super gunked up i'm sure that um what did that guy call it um somebody left a comment on my echo trimmer video um a spark arrester that's what it is it's definitely all clogged up i'm just gonna delete it uh entirely and i'll never have that issue ever again um but yeah so uh that definitely stinks figures and uh we got i got nine more in here or eight more in here today so uh, oh well i guess we'll uh just use the edger for the edges and then um yeah we'll just suck it up with the restricted weed eater all right guys just finished this one just a little backyard i just push mow it and uh that's it the hoa takes care of everything else so uh yeah just seven more in here and then uh maybe one more on the way home and then i'll be home all right i just pushed uh pushed out the last property um that's they're all mowed now so, uh the last seven i believe yeah seven uh and then that blue one they're all mowed i just gotta go around you know weed whack edge everything up uh definitely sucks with the the weed whacker you know how uh with the that restriction part but it is what it is this bag is super full but this mower has just been great um way better than the snapper it's like night and day definitely makes my life easier um makes the day go by faster um it walks so much faster just everything about it is better um you know everything about this setup uh, besides the equipment defender blower rack um i had that on the last trailer but uh, i guess and that toolbox too um, but I didn't have this mower, um, those racks, and then this trailer. So uh, those three things really make it like night and day. Um, just like landscaping and everything. I'm way less tired, uh, way less burnt out and everything. So it will be a pretty easy day. And I, I probably lost a solid hour, hour and a half today talking to people. Um, I did check out that job and I have to go back. They want me to check out the inside of the house. And then um, those cats too burn you know a solid 30 minutes with those cats trying to get them i'll probably go back tonight and uh bring over some wet food and stuff so whew, that'd be it 5 30 finished out the day a little later than i want to be but that is what it is actually uh yeah 5 30 end of the day uh, a little later than uh, i normally want to get off i want to be done by five but it is what it is got them all mowed today so uh yeah, I guess I'll see you guys back at the uh back at the shed.